Hello, my name is Rosalind Bearcat, and this is my first playthrough for the Rise of the Dark Fog expansion for Dyson Sphere Program. This is the Albada playthrough series. Hope you enjoy the gameplay. All right, we're going to get started here. Um, so a little bit of stuff that I did just cleaning up off camera. There are some things, though, that we need to produce today, and we're going to get busy on these. The first things are these right here. We need, uh, basically, we need the little pink containers, purple containers, whatever color you want to call that. It's a, technically, it looks pink, uh, but I, so I'm, I'm partially colorblind, so you never trust my judgment on what colors are. Um, it's, and then what we're going to do is we look at here. We do have some of these automated, but they, uh, we will definitely need more of those. And uh, that's what the pink containers are for. Then the other thing that we need is down here. We've act we're actually producing graphene, and that's coming in here. So we've got these improved assembly machines now. And honestly, I don't think there's any reason to use the lower level things and so we'll be quickly converting over to using those uh let's see here let's go ahead and produce eight stacks of those and then as far as this goes i'm going to pull some of these in here i'm actually going to take those out and start bringing in a couple of stacks of these we don't have anything automated filling back into our belts yet uh, we will definitely need to get that taken care of but we also have to produce missiles and we have to produce green motors we we don't have green motors automated either uh, we've got motors coming across but not being produced so that comes into here and then that's what feeds the belts here oh and that was not what i wanted wow oops there we go so that's the 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 goal there is to produce those things and to produce these so we're making some progress we've got plenty of these belts and sorters and other things we may eventually pull some of these sorters out but we've got these being produced and they're coming in you know so we've, we're doing good on that um, we've got these being produced and we will start using these pretty soon instead of the other ones because unlike the other ones whereas i really don't see the point in using these you know using the green sorters when these sorters will do because these sorters are cheaper um you know same thing with belts if i only need you know six per second belts i these work at a higher degree of efficiency so i kind of see a point to them but that's just me so let's get a few things building down here we're just going to put a few things in here we need what does this thing need we need green motors so we need a little plant that builds motors now we have green motors we've got these motors over here and so what we're going to do is we're just going to build a, a small facility here to build the green engines. And I'm not going to build a, not, probably not going to build this from a blueprint, but I am going to check my blueprints. You see, I don't have any blueprints for the green motors. Uh, let's see if I have things here. Now that is a one per second. Oh, look at how big that motor is. That just takes more than what my blueprint technology will do. So yeah we're going to do this differently production let's we'll, we'll still use the cheap ones here for now and what we're going to do is just put one in right here and let's see what we need in order to produce green motors electromagnetic turbines we need motors and electro and the magnets magnets are going to require iron and copper so there we go. Now I've already got this coming in, some of these. So what I'm going to do here, for the purposes of what I want, is I'm going to, I'm going to put a splitter in right here. We'll put that in there. Reconnect that belt up. And we're just going to bring this right up to here. Alright, I'm not even going to take it that far. We'll come right down here. We're going to put this in right here. Let's see. There we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to build two of these. I don't need a lot of these, so I'm just going to build two of them. All right, there we go.
Let's see here. Go there. Put all of those motors in there. Now we need coals. And so coals is going to require some iron and copper to come in. Now I've got iron and copper right over here. So let's go over here and just get because the uh, I need coals coming in here. I'm producing coals right here. Uh, I've got electromagnetic. I've got uh, these right in here. Uh, if I was to produce a little bit more of these, let's put one of those in there. Let's. I'm just extending this around to where I need. It'll do what I want it to do. We'll put one extra in there of that. And then we've got the coals coming down through here. Let's see if we can build one extra coal machine. There we go. We'll put. Hmm. Let's bring this on down to here. We're gonna need to turn this around here. We'll bring this down to here a little bit further. There we go. Just gonna build one extra machine here. It'll be there and there. Beautiful. We'll pop that in there. And I would think that I would have some magnets somewhere. Oh, I've got some of these. It doesn't look like I have any magnets. Okay. That's in there, that's in there. Very good. Now I have some magnets. We'll stick those in there too. Okay, there we go. Now, that being the case, this comes out onto the belt. Oh, it doesn't even have to come there. There we go. Very good. And then, I guess... Let's... that out run it down to here we go there pop those things in there and it's going to produce take that out put it in right there run this to here okay now with that in the place we can put that belt there that belt there that there, that there, and then we just run these things out. Like I said, I don't need a ton of these things, I just need a, a few. And we'll bring it all the way down to here and just right into there. And I have now built some green motors. Mm hmm. And what I'm going to do is come right over here because of the way I need the green motors to work. I'm going to put a belt right there, a box I mean. We are going to make that number four. We'll make that green motors. We will make this. But now we're going to make, uh, we're going to make the supply. We'll supply green motors. Honestly, I don't think these are set to demand, but that's okay. Right now, we're going to set this to be a supply. Uh, we're not going to be producing a whole lot of these things. Oops. I need some more of those. And I have those on the... Oh, here they are, right down here. I have some of these. Uh, wrong thing. There we go. Let's grab 50 of those. And how am I doing on the little spinners? Pretty good, but let's grab some more of those. Oh, that'll produce. Now with the little green motors here. That is supply. Was I demanding green motors down here? I was, and look at that. I'm going to let that stand. I'm going to take this back out of here. 
change my mind on this. Pull that out of there. Okay. I realize I'm just flying him down here closer, but hey, that is on a demand. Okay. I should be producing some of these. Yeah, there are some coming in here. Should be 50%. Put these in here. There we go. It should go grab some of these things and move them out. Very good. That is being produced. So I've got the green motors being produced and coming in right here. Now I also need to be producing some of the pink engines. Now the pink engines is just a box build. Um, and I believe if we look at the little, it's like these particle containers. And yeah, that was pink to me. All right, and so I need some gears, iron, some copper, and some graphene. Now I have graphene and gears right here. Look at there, I've got graphene and that. So I just need some copper. And guess what? There's a copper line right here. So let's do this right here. We're gonna stick a box right here. And we are going to strip it. We are, we are going to collect from Icarus. We'll put that in there. And so if I ever have copper, it'll pick it up for me and put it in the box. Let that go. I probably want to set this up. I should set all these boxes up that way. Let's see. I've got a ton of these things now. There is absolutely no reason not to set these up. And then if I need some of this stuff, I can get it from a long way away too. So there we go. We will collect from Icarus and distribute to other things. Okay. We will collect and provide. All right. Select and provide. Select and provide. Select and provide. Oops. Go. That's the gears. That way, if I ever have these things in my inventory, it'll just pick them up. And then if anybody's asking for these things, it will get them. I don't know that anybody's going to be asking for them. Dark form is launching an assault. Where are they coming from? Huh. They've got to be on another planet. Oof. Okay then. There we go. We're, let's get this. I'm gonna have to go check that other planet out and see what's going on. They they put down another base over there somewhere. Okay, we've got all of those done. Let's go ahead and get the items that I really use a lot of back in my being provided to me. So. Oh, I need to check the drone levels in each one of those things. Didn't do any good if I didn't put drones in them. That's got drones. That does not have drones. That one does not have drones. That has drones. Alright, there we go. This is probably the argument against why I should have not done this. Is all the drones that I use, but I do have a bunch of drones, so we're we're fine. And I don't have all uh, too many of these items that I'm picking up automatically right now. Anyway, I do want to be picking these up automatically. I want to be picking these up automatically. These and oh, these, not that. I'm gonna get rid of that actually. There we go. So provide and collect. Do this. And provide to Icarus. Oh. Alright, this right here will be provide to Icarus. 
some things in there. Maybe there. This will be provided to Icarus and put some items in there. Okay. I'm not going to do the... Well, I want to continue carrying the six belts. I think I do just because the, the these things are not free right now. So uh, I'm going to put a top hat on top of that as well. We're just setting up some logistics here. So I can come in here. We will provide these to Icarus. We'll put some drones in there. And I don't have any way to request them. Tell it how many I want. But that didn't do me any good at all, did it? So instead of power belts here, put these in here. We'll put that in there. We'll put that in there. I can carry these. These are the things I use a lot of. And then, I want to make sure I don't ever run out of fuel, so I'm going to keep that one in there. At least 300, at least 400. There should be at least 400 of those, and I need to get those back to producing. I'm, I'm putting on the, uh, what I'm doing. These, I'm going to come down here. Uh, actually, let's put this over here. I can organize these things a little bit. Down into the corner here, so I can I can put these like that. I want all those things stacked up right there. And I want to make sure I always have some of those. I want to always have some of those. I won't be carrying some of those. And I want a stack of those to be going with me everywhere I go. Some of the stuff needs to be dropped in a box and gotten rid of. Alright, there we go. And let's see. This right here. Settings. We want at least 100 and don't collect. This right here. We want at least 400 and don't collect. There we go. We want this right here to be 400 and don't collect. We want this right here to be 600 and don't collect. And same thing for this. Okay. That should deliver a whole bunch of items into my inventory over here. Now then I need another top hat right there. Or drones and tell this to provide to Icarus. There we go. That's going to be 200 there. That's going to be 600. That's going to be 600. We got a few too many of those. Okay. There we go. And then I need splitters down here. Let's see. What else should I have? And I won't. Bases. And then I want these towers down here. Like that. Okay. That will pin these things down there where I can see what I need of those. And then we've got other little things we need. So we've got the... Uh, we got the top hat there. We got the top hat there. Um, we've got plenty of power poles. We don't have these automated into our facility yet. Don't have any of those facilitated. Look at that. I do have a hundred of these things built now. Let's take some of those. All right, and then let's see. This, we'll drop those in there. And then 
All right, we're good. Let's see if we need anything else. We need a few of these in our inventory. We could certainly use some of those, but we don't have those. The photons. What I'm going to do is, right here, I'm just going to drop a box for now. And I'm going to put a few things in it that I really don't need to be carrying around. Now that I can probably find somewhere to put it. Oh, I've got a whole bunch of those sorters. Okay. So let's get the other item that we need. We need to get missiles being produced. We need missiles somewhere coming in. Um, and I need the combustion unit. Let's go back over here. Because I'm coming in here to the mall. I've got some items over here being produced where I've got the combustion items being done. But I don't ever. I'm not coming over here very often. So there's the items being produced here. I need to be producing these items somewhere else. I've got this being produced. Don't really need that. We've got coal over here. We can back some of this out and build some more coal in here and export it. Let's uh, let's see. Let's get the export. Let's get the coal built. And then I don't have the pink engines. Oh, I need the pink engines. Okay, that's next. Pink engines and some missiles so let's see there's my science probably filled back up on that on that yeah i did okay not quite ready to do that there we go that going the wrong direction let's turn around that is yeah my science isn't running we're going to redo our science because we're the next episode we're going to be working on yellow science that will be one of the things that we're doing here we go let's go right over here and see what we can do about getting... There's a coal vein. I haven't put a whole bunch of things in, so i tell you what we're going to do. Is we've got two large coal veins here. Let's take both of these things, and let's collect as much coal as I can get. So we'll start right here with these, with six items there, six items there. Four items there. Six. Get the six in there. Okay. We got a whole bunch of coal right there. Now let's go over here and do the same thing over here on this coal vein. Get as many of these little miners surrounding it as I can. All right. Six, three, three. Oh, foundation required. Look at there. I definitely need to get some more foundations. There we go. Back to my collector. And you may wonder why I'm not worried so much about how many of these things covered. The, uh... In this case, I'm just pulling it out and sticking it into the into a tower, and so I'm going to be 
In, in this case, I'm probably going to produce a whole bunch of the combustion elements. Um, how am I doing on my power graph? I'm actually doing quite well on it. Okay. So what we'll do then is... I don't know that I want to transport this anywhere. I think I want to produce some items down through here. So let's come right down through here. And we're going to build a little power plant down here to build. Let's see if I have early game. Mid game. I do not have a plant that's going to work. Okay, so let's see. Let's check on these combustion units. So the combustion unit here takes three, three items three seconds to produce one. Do I have anything else that does that? Three items, three seconds to produce one. I do, it's called steel. But I don't have a steel blueprint right now that does that. So what we wanna do here is a combustible unit. I can build an explosive unit too, but that would require plastic and that. I should, should certainly look at that. But what we need to do to build these is we need combustible units and engines. And engines would require some other items, copper. So we're gonna build a facility. We've got a facility that builds engines and already does some of that. We'll probably grab some of those engines, but we're going to need combustible units on the thing. So what we're going to do right here is just build a factory. Let's go ahead and get started on this. Let's see what we wanna do, grab some belts. I'm gonna want 12 item belts let's just stick this in here take a factory and take one of these and we'll start right here and let's see what we have nope wrong item we want the factory here let's see this is going to be combustible units. Three of them, three seconds to produce one. All right. Well, it's going to be basically one every four seconds. It takes four of those to produce three a second. All right. Well, then we're going to run a line down through here. And we're going to then... We can run, as we're doing a three for one combustion, we can run 12 in. If I run 12 and 12, that's 24. 24, three and one, it's going to be, I can run a 12 out. So I wanna do this down through here. Okay, there we go. All right. Well, then, let's see what we can do here. And we'll do this. We're going to see, let's see, that's nine. here and then we will connect it's in here we will connect that in there like that and that will start feeding in let's grab some additional coverage here like that and I'll to power up well you're kidding me. Alright, there we go. Everything's powered. And that is going to be producing combustible units. I don't think I really care how many. About all of that. 
let's see, we'll bring the rest of the others down on the other side. So what we're going to do is grab this and bring it down through here. Like that. Bring that in there. And what we'll do then is... Here we go. And while that's connecting up, we'll bring this right here. And that connects in rather awkwardly, but it's in there. Let's see, we got all that in there. All right, and then with that, we need power coming down through here. We'll grab this. Just put them in both sides. Why is there two gap? thing there between them. I don't know. It doesn't matter. This is more power than a holes than I need, but it's not going to hurt anything either. That goes in there, and then it goes right there. That'll connect all that up. Now let's get the... should have that belt flowing all the way down through there. It does. And we should be able then to make that just like that right there. There we go. Let's connect all this up and build a whole bunch of combustible units. I have no connectors. Oh yeah, I do. Look at there. Okay. Now this thing needs three seconds to produce, so it's one a second, so I can just use all yellow. That goes in, goes in, it goes in, it okay. comes out. Alright, there we go. We we'll just take this. All the way down. Take that all the way down. And let it fill in the connectors. And this will be producing combustible units. Lots of combustible units. It fills in down through here. There we go. Very good. Now what we want to do with the combustible units now is, let's see, we've got all of these up here, could be building even more combustible units, but I think I'll just leave those sitting there unpowered for now, and what I'm going to do is put this, let's see, We'll set that right there. I'm surprised that actually went in there with that pin. Ooh, it's very close to the water. And let's see. Combustible unit. That will be supply. We've only got one item in here. Actually, I'm going to put two items in here. I'm going to put the coal in here. I'm going to put 20 drones. This will just be straight up coal. 50. Or if I need power. I've got it. Let's connect that in, and then let's connect these up to it from both sides. So we're going to do this right down through here. Let's see. I'm going to do to here to here, and then down to there. And with that in, we will connect that to there, that into there, that into there. And then we'll go around the other side and do basically the same thing. Pulling this up and around this way. Right down through there. We go. And then we start connecting this into these three five 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 three we can definitely bring this one in on this belt as well with no problems and pull it down to here pull it over to here and 
right down into there. All right. There we go. That will be pulling lots of coal. All right, we'll put that there. That covering that part, that covering that, and that covering that. That'll power them all up. And I'll be stuffing a lot of coal into there as well as combustible units. Now that I've got combustible units here, I need to think about going somewhere and building some missiles. And then the one thing I still haven't done I said I was going to do was the purple engines. But we are running out of time. Um, and the purple engine things, what do they require? Let me see right quick. I need the green engines, I need copper, and I need graphene. Now I have graphene, copper, green engines being supplied. I've got green engines and graphene right here. So I can just run them out. And then I've got copper right over here. I can just pull it in on a... Well, so we're going to make a little spot right here to make purple containers. And then to supply them. So, okay. Instructors. I have four of these. And that's what I think I will produce. Actually, I just don't need that many. I'm just going to, for what I'm going to do right now, I'm just going to produce two. All right, that being the case, I need, that's probably not where I need them right there. Let's come here. And what I'll do is run this item out here. In fact, let's get that power pole right there and move it to this corner. That way it's still, pop it's still powered up. But I can put two lines coming out right here. There we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my gears and I'm going to bring my graphing. Right, I got both of those coming out. And then what I will do is we will... I don't know if however many I produce is just perfectly fine. We're going to take these. Are you going to put three of these in here? I think I am. It won't be producing very many. Uh, actually, I'm going to do two. Change my mind. Alright, there we go. And then with that, I'm going to be... This, 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 and this. Okay. Now this, in order to do particle containers, the other thing I need is copper. And in order to get copper, I'm going to bring a box and put it right here. I am going to, I only want one stack. What we do, I'll put these on here. I'm going to, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to pull from other places and I want copper ingots. Look at that, it's already doing it. Nice. So I've got a bunch of ingots coming in. And taking this down here and just running it right into there. These are going to be my purple containers that I need. So. This comes out here, it goes in there, it goes in there, and then that comes out there, it comes out there. And I should see, we'll just stick that right there. And there is my first purple container. And we will tell this that we are going to have particle containers and it is a supply. So do I, am I asking for particle containers down here? I don't know if I am or not, if I'm asking for them. I'm not asking for them here. Where do I need particle containers at? Right there. That is where I'm asking for particle containers. So what we will do then, that's where the overflow for the particle containers will is. Let's, um,
not the most efficient way of doing things, but hey. It's not going to hurt anything to do it this way. Just a little bit more of these things, and I have these right now to, to give away. So what we'll do is I'll run that in there. Put that off. All right, put that in there. And then this right here will distribute to other providers. Particle containers. Fill that up. Then once it has some of these things, there it goes. There's particle containers. And that, those things are going right on down there. there. That is just great. I want to see the particle containers show up right here. And we'll have our next item going. It is dropping off. There are particle containers. Well, I thought there were particle containers. Did they all run into here that fast? No. Surely not. Now I have particle containers. Very good. That will produce these. Wonderful. Alright, I need the the base item somewhere. Where is my one of these base items right here? Uh, I'm gonna grab a couple more of these for my inventory. And then I what I don't have, I'm, I'm not automating right now, is the signal tower. And that'll have to be for another episode. In our next episode though, we are going to work on getting yellow science started um, and getting our science back on track starting to do some more research. I think we're at a good stable point. Uh, oh, we have another planetary threat. Let's go see what this is before we call off here. Uh, oh, that's on a ball, uh, ball the one. All right, that'll be for the next episode. That is all for today's video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to hit the like button and leave a comment to let me know what you think. Please subscribe to the channel to be notified when new content is available and check out the link shown here for more gameplay. Take care.